Hello everyone, in this episode we will be done with Joo Kyung because he knew that Kian was threatening Joo Kyung. Joo Kyung cried when she found out that Wo Hyuk was going to leave her, but the sadness didn't last long. When the truth was revealed, they decided to date. In this episode, Kian heard that there was a hidden camera belonging to Sang Jo. He was busy looking for the hidden camera so that no one knew about his crime against Sang Cho. He thought that maybe Joo Kyung had a hidden camera, and he was afraid that Joo Kyung would slowly strangle him. Therefore, he planned to get rid of Joo Kyung forever. He reasoned that he wanted to improve his company's image by making news about him and Joo Kyung having a good relationship, even though they were divorced, and Kyung allowed Joo Kyung to meet Sua. That night, Joo Kyung was supposed to took Jae Kyung to the airport because Jae Kyung would receive treatment in the United States. After that, she would meet Sua. However, Joo Kyung wouldn't take Jae Kyung. She would go with Sang Pil. Joo Kyung and Sang Pil got into the same car. Meanwhile, Jae Kyung was driving a different car whose brakes had apparently been damaged by Kyung. This was where Jae Kyung had an accident. In the preview of episode 27, Joo Kyung sees Kyun in the hospital. She also sees Tak Sung Gu following Kyun. Joo Kyung follows them and this is where Joo Kyung hear their conversation. Joo Kyung finally knows that Kyun wants to kill her. Kyun sees Ye Kyung's body which he thinks is Joo Kyung and he is satisfied because he has gotten rid of Joo Kyung with his own hands. Meanwhile, Yu Kyung, who already knows that Kyun wants to kill her, create a scanner year to trick Kyun. She changed Ye Kyung's name to her name, so that Kyun believes that she is really dead. When Kyun pretends to be sad and cries, Yu Kyung says Kyun. She said that she will die according to Kyun's wishes, and she also makes sure that she will tear Kyun to pieces with her own hands. Okay, everyone. That's the previous time and thank you for watching my video.